You know, when Pastor was saying that, you know, um, we're going to have a training doing evangelism. I thought it was just a training here at church, right? So it was kind of like, okay. And then Pastor um, David goes, oh, yeah. And in a few minutes, we're going to be going house to house. I was like, oh, house to house. Oh, my gosh. I haven't done that. Evangelism to us has always been a little bit of a challenge. We did not really have a um, system for evangelism uh, or even a structure. We were a little nervous. Both of us had never, had never really done anything like this. Not really was I a door-to-door, knock door-to-door person. To tell you the truth, I was going to go home and come back later. I really was. We had gone out in twos, and my partner uh, and I had come across a, a woman who was actually watering her front lawn. So we walked and approached her and asked her uh, if we could pray for her. She was extremely uh, receptive and happy that somebody would even take the time to do so. One house, we told him, hey, uh, we're here in the neighborhood and we're praying for this community. And we were here to find out if there's something we can pray for you today. And he, you know, hesitated a little bit. And then he opened the door and let us, you know, touch him and pray for him. And that was really awesome. We didn't have an opportunity to pray for anybody until the last house. A gentleman named Earl answered. And we said, um, hi, Earl, we want to let you know that you are awesome, and God thinks that you are awesome. If there's anything on your mind or your heart that you would like us to pray about, we'd like to pray with you. With the approach of prayer, people just seem to be very disarmed and more, more open, uh, receptive. I've already seen some confidence that now they can do this, and I'm encouraging them to um, really influence the people in the, their circle of influence just simply represent in love and in thoughtfulness and in approach. We have a responsibility to our, especially to our family, to our neighbors and our community that we need to share. I look forward to going out again to be able to pray for them. And I think if you just give it a shot, try it once, I think you, you too will just find this just a, a freedom to share.